All right, this is the NAU Aquatic Center project, and we are the steel team, Ertz and Bros, that will be constructing this project for you. Um, here is Grayson, the project manager, and here is Dalton, our foreman that will be working. I'm Tommy Zamora, the project executive. So, our site is going to be accessed directly from the 40 when we're talking about steel deliveries, and it's going to be entered through Beaver Street when you come just off um, Butler Avenue. And once you're in the site, we're going to have a delivery location that can be front in and backed out. And from there, we'll enter our site logistics plan, where we'll actually be unloading from the truck and putting into our steel laydown yard right here. We're going to use a heavy boom lift that will be on the project for the duration of the steel erection process. This will actually be the steel laydown location for the first and second sequences in our erection plan. Um, from then, this section of the building will be finished and we'll be then to work on this bottom portion of the building. We'll have to move our laydown into this part of the site during that process. So from there, I will pass it off to Grayson to talk about schedule. So we've begun our schedule with the quantity takeoff uh, to allow for us to determine how much steel we need to order for the project. So directly after the quantity takeoff, we'll be ordering the steel for the project and also beginning our submittal process. Once their submittal process is complete, on 412, we'll begin mobilizing crew for the steel erection, which is expected to be done on 815 with substantial completion. Once substantial co completion is finished, we'll begin inspection of the site and punch list for any errors that may have occurred. After a punch list, uh, we'll begin closeout on 916, and our project is determined to end on 925. I'll pass it off to our foreman, Don Ertz. Yeah, so uh, just for the budget breakdown, for this uh, project, we decided to use the 2007 version of RS Means. So for all the steel takeoffs, that's where we got our estimates and our costs. Um, as you can see, we broke it down to structural steel, open web steel joists, and metal decks into three different sections. So for our structural steel, we're going to end up spending about $2.5 million on that. And then for open web steel joists, it's going to be about $50,000. And then for the metal deck, it's going to be about um, $460,000, which brings us to a grand total of about $3 million for the whole project. So that's what we're looking at in terms of a bid for this project. And, uh, Thank you for your time.